Hello guys, welcome to my channel. This today, today is a very special edition of uh, uh, performance reviews, so this time with the Gru game. As you can see, we have here a bunch of settings to choose. We have here the Ultra, which uh, I'm showing there these options that are on high. And you can't select Ultra because uh, they don't exist, really. And actually brings... If you have an AMD graphic card, you can choose until 8 times multi and TV Azing. But uh, if you have an NVIDIA, you can choose uh, TXAA, which is uh, their anti proprietary NTV Azing. So I'm gonna choose Ultra and FXAA. It's, uh, it's too much. It's too much. So I'm gonna continue my journey for this huge map over here. And see some instructions. Let's get back here. Right, I don't care about this. And... Okay, I'm waiting. Oh, oh my god, so much players. So we're gonna start in Miami, over here, and since we don't have missions over here, I need to go to the airport. Uh, as you can see, there is nothing here, and I need to set the waypoint. So we're gonna travel a little bit through Miami, and you're gonna see how beautiful it is. So I have this hey, uh, Nissan 370Z and in the rest of the game you're gonna see me racing, you're gonna see me modifying completely the car visually, in for speed style. Uh, you're gonna see me too... Oh, this, this is awesome. We have a bunch of cameras and everything. Jesus. Okay. So I'm gonna shut up myself and I'm gonna let you enjoy the video. So... Let me just show you that I'm running with hardcore difficulties just for you don't blame my, my asshole driving so see you soon Everywhere. 
Hit it. Go, go, go. ourselves a police warning level here. You know how to lose that shit, right? Drive really fast and don't get caught? Pretty much. You gotta get out of range of these knuckleheads. The longer they can't see you, the more the chase drops off. And if you start crashing into civilians and smashing stuff up right in front of them, they'll bring a world of pain down upon you. Got that? I got it. Got it. Roger that. All units, stand by. What did you do? Well, yo, so you just automatically assume I did something, right? I'm guilty until proven innocent, right? Nah, no, man. I didn't mean anything by that. No, <laughs> set All right, show. Good job. I owe you one. Anything to report? Just saved Troy from a stretch in jail. Same old, same old. I'll pick him up when you've got your ink. Stay on mission. first or this whole operation is over.
You're Troy's new driver, huh? Looking for that 510 ink? Who's this? Your replacement. Unless you beat me on the track. The location's on your map. You been beefing. That ain't good for me or my hood. And I need to send a guy to St. Louis. So this is how it's gonna be. Winner gets a promotion. Loser takes it as a life lesson, and this argument is over. Another step towards the ink. Good. Troy's moving on St. Louis, and I'm his weapon of choice. Looks like you've got a road trip ahead of you. Set a waypoint for St. Louis. I'll keep tracking you from here. Oh, and be careful around Troy. He's got a bad rap sheet. Great. I'll be in touch. Like I said, Detroit's got a little crowder for a man of my ambition. So we're setting up shop in St. Louis. Here's the location of St. Louis, V2. Find her, and kill her. What? You heard me.
Troy wants me to kill the St. Louis V2. Damn it. Take her down. I'll work on getting her off the streets. Protective custody, something. After her. It's on now. Hey Zoe, we need to get this girl out of town before Troy finds her. Okay. Keep him busy while I work it through. I killed her. Stone Cold! With the V2 out of the game, we can start claiming territory for Detroit. Check your map for races, records to break, any way you can kick some St. Louis ass. strike fast. The plan? Check it out. It's a street race at dislocation. The sooner Detroit starts taking scouts, the better. Hello guys, welcome back to the performance section of the game and as you can see on Ultra Plus FXA I have an uh, average of uh, 36 and on I, I have uh, or I or a medium, the frame rate are very similar. I get 60 frames in some cases, and this was running a track called Initiation, the track that you saw on the video. So I decided to try to, to test it out to the free roam through East Coast to Miami, but I, I had run into some problems uh, due to server problems and instability. And so on Ultra Plus FXA, I tested. Uh, inside the east coast and then I roamed half of the way to, to Miami but uh, well the servers crashed and so uh, that was what I get on Ultra. On I, I tested out uh, through half of the way that I was made it already to Miami. Uh, looking at this you may think hey but if I put the game on I, I, I run most of the cases at 60. Well that is not true uh, because I don't know why but there wasn't too many traffic around in that place, and so the game was not demanding. But I, I free roam a lot in this closet beta, and there are some places that are more demanding than the others. Uh, depends too on the time of the day. There are some times of the day that the game is more demanding, and so. But anyway, if you decided to play on I, you get uh, 40s of minimum and maybe average between 50s or 60s. One thing I, I need to advise you is that, well, uh, you can unlock the frame rate to 60, like uh, I publish that annotation that on the on the beginning of the video, and you can click it on this red square again to unlock the 60 frames on the closet beta, but look guys, uh, that doesn't really work well. There are some bugs, uh, animations of the cars are not working properly, cutscenes are not working properly, my game crashes uh, sometimes and uh, when I decided to put the lock again to 30s, the game was running, well it was running at 30 of course, but it was more smooth and and well, I didn't have had problems with animation. So I, I, I hope that uh, every tower just release the game in a final version with support to 60. Not for me, because I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna play at 30s, but for people that have better PCs than mine. 
they deserve to play at 60 this awesome game that I tested out this really convinced me to buy this game I, I really didn't like uh, or I really wasn't saw anything special about this game but after playing it I, I feel that I'm playing Test Drive Unlimited 1 plus Need for Speed this is really awesome uh, reminds me of the time of Need for Speed Most Wanted uh, mix it with test drive. This is just us. Awesome. So that's all I want to talk about to crew performance review. I'm gonna try to release a video on my laptop too, but I can't promise it. But okay. So see you soon, guys. Hope you'd like it.